it's been fun. The the juniors and U23 guys all showed up, really put on a great tournament, came here to wrestle. Uh, you couldn't tell that uh, anybody was coming off quarantine. Nope, and Kaka in on a single. Heinzelman said it's his points. Instead, we get a one step out for Heinzelman. Oklahoma, Cody Brewer wants a challenge. Or does he challenge? Yes, he, yep, they're debated. grabbing the official. I think this is a pretty decent challenge. It's early on in the bout. Uh, it's not going to totally change the future, the complexion of the of the match. No. If they win, it's two to nothing. If they lose, it's two to nothing the other way. Hunter Katka, whose last name is just screaming for the nickname Big Cat. Yes, Hunter he Big Cat Katka. Heavyweights. Although, species, I believe he is an Amakai Lewis singlet. Yeah, that shouldn't, I mean, Makai Lewis should not be able to wear the same size clothes as a heavyweight, especially a large heavyweight like Katka. He's a Pennsylvania state champ. He's a champ of just about every tournament you can win in high school. World teamer. Made the 2019 cadet world team. It's pretty good is what we're saying. <laughs> Josh Heinzelman, no slouch himself. Looking to be the long-term Oklahoma, or the heavyweight for the Sooners. As we review that, I don't know what I would have called there. I did not get a good look at it. It's the far side of the mat. Might be tough for that camera that they're using for the review as well. It's the camera hooked up to that computer. It's not the feed that you're seeing at home. Or wherever you are, you don't have to be home to watch. You can watch on the fly, because you know what we have? An app. We have an app for that. That's right. And you can watch on your phone, on your tablet. Who, nobody has tablets now, though. I think tablets are still a thing. They are still a thing? Are iPads considered tablets? Yeah, I think I, I, iPads are tablets. Yeah, I think people still have iPads. Okay. All right, so if you got your iPad or other tablet device. Yeah. So it is rule Cactus points. Good challenge by Cody Brewer in the corner. Southeast RTC, that's the Virginia Tech's RTC. Oklahoma RTC, obviously, for the Sooners. Oh, they are flying. They got yeah. arms going back and forth. You hear some applause from the uh, smattering of fans that are still here in the event center. Oklahoma folks are here. Heinzelman not backing down. Kaka got a little bit of reach advantage, certainly a height advantage. I think it helps when coaches call you by your full name during a match. Yeah. It's like, here's what you got to do, then your full name. <laughs> Just sinks in better. Got a minute and 50 to go in the first period. Just the two points from Katka on that reviewed sequence on the far side of the mat. Hunter Katka has 10 or 11 owed his way to this point. So still yet to give up a point. And now he's got Heinzelman defending. Heinzelman jumps behind. And there are two points. <laughs> wow, Kaka really thanks you for jinxing him, JD. Sorry, Big Cat. <laughs> I better apologize. He's like three of you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the center, high crotch. Heinzelman absorbing these blows. Heinzelman staying on the attack. All right, Team Oklahoma is still in the house here. Kaka gingerly walking back to the center. He's got a little brace knee pad on the left leg. Seems okay though. Less than one minute to go. Kaka blocking off that underhook with his left arm.
Referee breaks him up, restarts him. 40 seconds to go in the first period. Slow down for the tactical battle that is the heavyweight. Typical heavyweight match. Short time. See if anybody wants to steal a point. Is it going to be Heinzelman? Yes, it is. Snap down, go behind. Looking for a turn. Their heads are out of bounds, though, so no points there. Coach Roselli in the corner for Heinzelman. And we're about to head into the break. Oh, oh. I think I think there was one second on the board. Stealing two points. Eight. Stealing two sets of two points in the final there. And Kaka once again. A big opening period for Joshua Heinzelman. Yeah, and while we're at this break period, I think we should thank all the folks that made this event possible. It's not easy in this environment. USA Wrestling following every COVID protocol and then some helping invent some COVID protocols for wrestling tournaments to be held. Uh, the Event Center, all the people of Omaha, Zach Dominguez and N MWC for all the volunteers mm -hmm. and all the hard work they're putting in. This would not be possible without a whole army of people, and we thank them very much. Final period of the event. We'll wrap things up after this. Five-point lead for Josh Heinzelman. Did not expect to see him in this position, so credit to him. He's wrestling opportunistically. Once again, Heinzelman digging that right side underhook. Kaka blocking off with his left hand. Now they just switch. Heinzelman digs the left underhook. Hein Katka blocks off with his right arm. They could almost make a drill out of that. <laughs> that this has been the money maker for Heinzelman in this match is snap down go behinds off the shots from Katka. And a strong butt drag gets him there. Two more, nine to two, seven point lead. And it's at the point where Heinzelman can start thinking tech fall. Hunter Kaka, kudos to his offense. He continues to shoot. The entire bout, he's probably outshot Heinzelman 7 8 to 1. But the score is the reverse of that. There, Kaka gets in this a nice is his shot. Best opportunity to score since his opening takedown. Heinzelman His has a singlet. got trapped in the singlet of Heinzelman. You don't see that very often. We're, we're going to need a, uh, a nah, smaller we're, singlet. We're going to need some blood time here from Katka. So Katka gets a two. But Heinzelman with the turn totally negates that advantage for Katka. 65 seconds left to go. Seven point lead still for Heinzelman. Are you surprised by that, JD? Uh, I'm a little surprised. Uh, Kaka, a uh, mega recruit for Virginia Tech. And not that Heinzelman uh, is bad, you know, a two time Oklahoma State champion, couple time Fargo All American. But on paper, you're thinking Kaka's the favorite, and he looks so good. Up until this point, but yeah, ripping through the tournament, taking nothing away from Josh Heinzelman. Uh, he's earned the points and he's earned the position he's in. Uh, but a, a little bit of a surprise, knowing Katka's history. So 
See if he can continue this potential upset. Kaka not drop, not backing down at all. Good knee slide, repenetration. That'll be two. And a little bit of life from Kaka. And the Virginia Tech contingent that's here springs to life as well. 50 seconds. Two high scoring heavyweight finals today. Yeah, not bad. Like it when the heavyweight scores some points. Kaka in again. Now he's cradled up by Heinzelman. He'll let go of that to collect two more because he wants those insurance points. Thirty seconds. Twenty nine officially on the clock. And a uh, more blood smear of blood all over the face of Hunter Kaka. I understand why they need to clean up the blood and, and safety and all that precaution, but maybe one day we just rest and we just let the blood go. <laughs> just like UFC. That's a interesting take. No, well, just, you know, a little, a little hardcore wrestling style. Okay. At, at some point, they didn't used to always have blood time, right? Go back long enough. As long as I can remember, there's always been blood time. As long as I can remember, too. <laughs> I'm just saying. You know. Works in other sports. Andrew Spay, fan of blood. I'm <laughs> just saying, maybe the wrestlers <laughs> want it that way too. All right. We got a blood sport going here in the finals. 22 seconds to go. Kaka furiously trying to make up that difference. He's running out of time. There goes the nose plug. Yeah, that lasted <laughs> five seconds. And one more go behind for Heinzelman. He'll probably stay down on the mat. Nope. We'll go back up. Ah, uh, yep, and it's on the mat. So they're going to have to clean it. <laughs> See? Look, I'm not the only one with this ID idea. Well, Brewer said that. Be Cody Brewer, the corner said, can we just go this four seconds? But it's because it's four seconds. What if this happens with two minutes and 40 seconds? That's a fair point. <laughs> <laughs> what if it happens and you don't have all these hotel towels that you can use at your disposal? True. Four seconds, Kaka charging in. Heinzelman, no points. And it's Josh Heinzelman, 15 to 6. Wow, very close yeah, to flex his Flex on him, young man. Big so, win for Josh Heinzelman. Very impressive stuff. He gets... <laughs> He gets a photo with someone who's about uh, one-eighth the size of him. The young volunteers help.